Hey guys, it's Kyle from GoVacuum.com showing you how to change a belt on a Recar 8900 series vacuum cleaner. Let's get started. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is flip the Recar on its front so the back is facing up. And then you see two Phillips screws right here. And you're going to want to take those off. So first one. And the second one. Now whatever you do, you want to make sure you do not misplace these two screws. And after you take those two screws out, the plate's going to lift right up and off. As you can see, the belt is broken. So what we're going to do is take this metal piece out. It lifts right out from under there. Okay. Set that off to the side. And then you're going to want to lift up this door. Now I call this the belt door. So open up the belt door. And if your belt isn't broken, just warn. It would be wrapped right around the motor pulley right there. So you can flick that right off of the motor pulley. And then you can pull the brush roll straight out. Now while you're down here, you can take a damp cloth with a window cleaner or even water. And you can you know, wash this area out and make sure there's no dust. You can wipe this all out and make sure there's no dust that could be affecting your vacuum cleaner's performance. And also, while you're here, go ahead and remove any hair or anything that might be obstructing the brush roll. As you can see, this one spins, you know, really, really smoothly. So don't need to worry about that. Just make sure, you know, all the dirt and, ev and everything is off of it. A little bit of hair there, it can pull that right off. Now what you're going to want to do is take your new belt. I will put the parts in the description of this video. Take your new belt and put it around the motor pulley, as you can see right there, and feed the brush roll through, making sure that the plastic black end gets the belt. You're going to want to take the vacuum and actually put it up so it's in a locked position. And you're actually going to stand behind the vacuum cleaner and push down, applying even pressure to both sides of the brush roll. So that way you can get a good position on it. And then you're going to push it into place. So that way it's easier to push the belt because of the tension. So you're going to take it, make sure the belt's lined up, apply even pressure to both sides, And then push the brush roll right into place. And what you can do is you can spin the brush roll a few times, making sure that it's nice and free. Make sure everything spins correctly and that nothing is locked up on the vacuum. You want to make sure everything is nice and smooth. Now after you do that, you're going to want to just do the steps in reverse order. You're going to close the brush roll door. Take that metal piece that I showed you earlier, which is a little divider. I'm going to put it right back into place. And you can lay the vacuum cleaner back down. And push the plate on, making sure that this lip goes over these notches of plastic in the vacuum. So push those notches up and then push the plate on. And then you can reapply your two screws. And there you have it. That's how you replace the belt on a Recar 89 series upright vacuum cleaner. And as always, we like to hear from you guys and like to know what kind of problems you guys are facing. And if you would like us to make a video, send us a request at help.govacuum.com. Send us a shout out and let us know what you'd like to do and what you'd like to know from us.